attaching uh, a bought some new tools. I bought a, a bandsaw and also a um, finisher, belt sander, whatever you want to call it. Um, <clears throat> there's two machines available at Hair and Forbes, uh, which I went to and I spoke to them about the machines. I said, this is what I'm doing. This is what I need to do. Um, I need to cut the time down. It's taking too long. I basically have had a grinder, a drill, and an air sander to basically make everything that I've ever done. Um, I've also bought recently a plasma cutter, stuff like that. Um, they do have them available there. You'll see in the um, in the video where I walk around the, the warehouse, which is amazing. They have um, some really, really big, heavy equipment. Plasma cutters, like um, plasma tables, laser tables, um, just amazing. You'll see the video. It is cool as shit. Um, anyway, so I bought the two little baby machines. It's probably the two smallest machines that they had there. Um, it's like the second or third in my life. But <clears throat> so I bought a bandsaw for the reason of the grinder. Um, I cut everything with a grinder or, um, or a plasma cutter, um, and then I could grind it anyway. So basically, this um, this one that has a vertical cutting table, so I can cut in that way and cut things just like on on the vertical, or I um, put them in there and cut them down like this, um, and it just it slowly feeds itself because it's really just lightly touching on there. Um, anyway, that was the reason for that is to get rid of the grinder, well, less grinder work. Um, and the linisher sander, um, not just like aluminium, when you, you'll see here when you cut anything with a grinder, you get these dirty big burrs. Yeah, you can clean it up and all that, but you still have this edge here, which you can't weld, you actually have to sand it. And you guys don't actually see me do a lot of that, but I do that with this, a normal sander. Um, where I can just walk over to the, the sander now, punch it on there, and it's done. Uh, it just cuts my time down to half, if not less. So, um, also, <coughs> sand's nice, really, really, really nice. Little bevels on your pipe when you go to um, weld your, your butt welds. So, when you're doing exhaust manifolds and stuff like that, you want a perfect, nice butt weld. Um, seeing world. Anyway, that's the purpose for that. I just want to say a massive thank you to Hair and Forbes. They really looked after me with these. Um, you know, they yes, they do so a big commercial side, industrial side, um, but they do do a lot with the DIY guys like myself and most of you guys watching. So um, if you want to check out their store, I'll put a link in the description to check them out. Um, and yeah. We'll do some, do some cuts and stuff and show you what it's all about.
quieres andar conmigo, quieres estar juntito 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 Get, get, get.